Hi, this is Harish Bari from technofair.com. If you are changing your Android device or formatting it, you may want to take complete backup of your data with its associated files. For that, there is a feature under developer options of your Android that allows you to take desktop backup with password. This password encrypts your data, so remember it. If you lose your password, you lose your data. You can also take backup of your data without password. Well, the whole process is safe, but I will still urge you to follow it at your own risk. To learn more, watch this video. To begin this procedure, first thing we need to do is to download the Android SDK toolkit and install the same. Downloading link is given in the description below. Let me download the same. It's developer.android.com slash SDK slash win slash usb dot html enter download go little down other download options this one is for windows and this link is for mac i am clicking on windows go little down and accept the terms i agree download the installer Android SDK is a software development kit that is used by developers to create applications for Android. It's a 133 MB file. So this can take four to five minutes depending upon your internet speed. Let's now run the installer. Run next. At this moment, you will need the Java SE development kit while I have got it on my system. If you don't have it, please look for the link in the description below. Next install for anyone using this computer next it's saving it under c next tall next finish we need to now run the sdk manager for that let's go go to the program that's on c drive program files android android sdk folder and this is the sdk manager open this and run the application it's opening the android sdk manager window for the purpose of taking backup of your android device we need only these two options android sdk tools and android sdk platform tools so check only the first two options and uncheck the rest once you are through with this click on install package i have already got this one installed android sdk tools so it's saying already installed one package other one is getting installed select accept and install don't close this window until this completes so let's close all these windows and go to computer click right and then properties go to advanced system settings from the left hand side navigation environmental variables look for the path this is the path c program data oracle and now edit so what we now to need to do is after this path skype slash phone slash we need to enter the path where the program is placed i have got it on a notepad so i am copying this it's under the program files under c drive android folder android hyphen sdk is the folder name and pasting this here okay 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 for ease of this tutorial i have connected my android device with this computer this is the device screen for this to happen your usb debugging option should be on or your android i have got a tutorial on this how to enable a usb debugging option on your android for which you can look out at description below link is given but i'll show you where that usb debugging option is there it's under settings go a little down and you will see the same under developer usb debugging is checked let's go back now we need to open command prompt for that simultaneously press windows key plus r from your keyboard and type cmd okay command prompt will open type adb space device this will search for the device enter now to take backup enter the command adb space backup space hyphen 
ऑल ए एल एल स्पेस हाइफिन ए पी के स्पेस हाइफिन एफ स्पेस बैकअप डॉट ए बी एंटर इट इज नाउ गिविंग मी ऑप्शन टू टेक फुल बैकअप यू कैन टेक बैकअप विद अ पासवर्ड और विदाउट अ पासवर्ड आई एम टेकिंग इट विदाउट अ पासवर्ड बैकअप माई डेटा लेट्स गो टू द कमांड प्रॉम्प्ट दिस इज शोइंग नाउ अनलॉक योर डिवाइस एंड कन्फर्म द बैकअप ऑपरेशन सी कॉलम यूजर्स डेल दिस मीन्स दिस इज द पाथ ऑफ बैकअप इट्स अंडर द डेल फोल्डर अंडर यूजर्स एंड सी ड्राइव दिस मीन्स दैट बैकअप इज सक्सेसफुली डन लेट्स हैव अ लुक कंप्यूटर्स सी ड्राइव यूजर्स डेल दिस इज द बैकअप फाइल बैकअप डॉट ए बी so this backup has been successfully created let's learn how to restore the same once you are through with formatting of your phone connect your android device with your computer using usb and then ensure that your usb debugging option under developer options is checked go back to command prompt the way we explained in this tutorial and then type adb device in the cmd dialog box which will locate the device and then you will need to enter the restore command which is adb space restore space backup dot ab and hit enter let's look at the screen i now need to click on restore my data this restoring will take almost the same amount of time it took while the backup was created that was all about taking backup of your android data if you found this video useful do give it a thumbs up also watch other interesting videos by clicking on the links appearing in front of your screen don't forget to subscribe to this channel and thanks for watching